Hello, boys and girls. How are you? Are you having a wonderful morning so far? Well, before we look at the message, I wanted to share with you that Bear is wearing his mask. Do you see Bear's mask on his face? Bear was reminding me that we need to wear a mask to be safe from the coronavirus. Have you been practicing wearing a mask? Remember, we need to practice being socially distant, but some of you are gonna be going into the building to learn at school, and you're gonna be wearing a mask for more than six hours a day. Have you been practicing? If you signed up to be at school, Make sure that you're practicing now. Why don't you put your mask on and practice it every day of school? Because you're going to have to be practicing. It's going to be over six hours and you can't take the mask off. So guess what? Cookie Monster wanted to wear a mask too. Do you see Cookie Monster over here? So Cookie Monster has his mask on. And Cookie Monster wanted to remind us that we need to be socially distant. Do you see how Bear and Cookie Monster are a space apart? Now they protected themselves with their masks and they are practicing. So boys and girls, make sure you practice too. Let's go ahead and look at our message. Are you ready? Show me that you are a team and a class family. Go ahead and use your finger to point underneath the words. Remember, follow along with your eyes and listen with your ears. November 5th, 2020, dear class family, today is Thursday. We will learn a lot at school. We will go to music class. It is a great day. Love, Miss Joyner. It is a great day. Let's get back at our message at the top. Do you see where the date is? Let's go ahead and read it again together. Are you ready? November 5th, 2020. Look at the first sentence right here. Do you see it? What is today? Hmm. Look back, readers. Today is Thursday. If you knew that today was Thursday, go ahead and kiss your brain. Do you know what we're doing for specials today? Hmm, look back at the message. I see a sentence right here, and I see a picture of music notes. Where are we going for specials? Hmm, read it with me. We will go to music class. We will go to music class today. Now, before we have music class, readers, we're gonna learn how to interact with stories. So I'm gonna be sharing a lot of different special things with you this morning during language arts. During math today, we're gonna be comparing collections of amounts and see which one is more, and which one has fewer, and are they the same amount? We're gonna be talking about that. During social studies, we're gonna be talking about wants and needs. All right, some friendly reminders. Remember, communicators, I'm gonna want you to use this button so I can hear your voice. And if other people are speaking in the class, make sure your microphone is off so that we can hear who's speaking, okay? And remember, if you are sharing your work, switch your video camera from off to on. All right? And I'm going to be checking who's there. So make sure if you're at your laptop and I, if I ask, are you there sitting at your laptop to raise your hand by pressing the raise the hand button and then practice raising your hands at home. Okay? Or unless you're at daycare. All right? Okay. So boys and girls. We are going to be doing a special question today. Are you ready for our special question? Okay, so speaking of beautiful things, and one of the things that I know that many of you really enjoy drawing and looking at are rainbows. 
I know that so many of you in kindergarten love using these very special rainbow colors. Red, orange, yellow, green, blue, purple. You love to use these colors. So it made me wonder, hmm, do you like rainbows? And I didn't know the answer to this question. I know that some people in our class family have told me already how much they do like rainbows. But I want to know, do you like rainbows? So we're going to go into a breakout group and we're going to put our microphone buttons on. And when you put your microphone button on, you are going to be sharing your answer with your group and the teacher in your group. Okay? Do you like rainbows? All right, let's go ahead and talk about it.